A European Naval Force helicopter fires warning shots at Pirate Skiff off the coast of Somalia. Navy commandos approach on speedboats to make an inspection. The pirates are surrounded. They throw the ladder at sea along with their weapons to get rid of any incriminating evidence. This is just one of many pirate incidents that Greek Commodore Antonios Papayoanou has dealt with. For 122 days he was patrolling the Gulf of Aden in the Arabian Sea as the first force commander to lead Operation Atalanta, the European Union initiative to stop piracy off the Somali coast. In 2008 we had εκ των οποίων οι περίπου 45 ήταν επιτυχείς, που σημαίνει μία στις δύο έως μία στις τρεις επιθέσεις ήταν επιτυχείς. Στη διάρκεια των τεσσάρων μηνών απεδείχθη ότι μία στις έξι επιθέσεις ήταν επιτυχείς. Ε, αυτό ήταν ένα σημαντικό επίτευγμα. The waters of Somalia's coast are among the most dangerous shipping lanes in the world. Until early April, the European Anti-Piracy Task Force has managed to thwart dozens of pirate attacks against cargo ships and other vessels. Greek frigate Psara was part of the operation. There were many times that have been very deep in our lives. One of them was the time of the release of the pirates after their attack on a Norwegian ship. Children, 18 and 22 years old, ε, εμφανώς πεινασμένοι, καταπονημένοι, διαπράξαν αυτό το διεθνές έγκλημα και κοιτάζοντας τα μάτια τους έρχεσαι αντιμέτωπος με όλη την πραγματικότητα της Σομαλίας. Σομάλι πάιρετς are operating across a vast area, four times the Mediterranean Sea. Greek frigate Psara has traveled over 30,000 miles, about one and a half times the length of the equator, trying to combat piracy in the Gulf of Aden and the Indian Ocean. Modern pirates use modern tools to capture their victims. Armed with AK-47 rifles, rocket launchers, satellite phones and GPS, Somali pirates are determined to risk their lives for cash. The rules of engagement authorize the use of force, but under the Greek command it was never used, not even in the pirate attack against a European tanker. Καταφέραμε με τη χρήση ενό κανόνα εμπλοκή που προέβλεπε προειδοποιητικά πειρά για μία ώρα, που σημαίνει περίπου 200 εισβολέ του ελικόπτερου κατά του πειρατικού σκάφου, να κινητοποιηθεί το σκάφο και να έχουμε έτσι το ίδιο επιθυμητό αποτέλεσμα χωρί τη χρήση βία. Commodore Papayoanou says the force has pushed the pirates further out to sea, but their presence still haunts the Indian Ocean and has become a real nightmare for international shipping. This is Mariana Petraki of VRT Greece for CNN World Report.